Holy shit. What the heck is that? What's going on everybody? My name is Ender Android and welcome back to Atomic Heart. Now this episode took a little longer to do because I kept trying to record, but the frames kept dropping and I wasn't getting anywhere with good material. And because of that, I played like 30 minutes before checking on it. So this is 30 minutes into the future. You didn't miss much. I just saw a giant worm, um, talking corpses, and you know, that's about it. But um, last time we were here, we met the most horniest, the most horny refrigerator I could think of. And I'm, I'm not sure how to feel about that. I feel like there's going to be more <laughs> innuendos in this game. But without further ado, let's get in, let's get back into it. Oh yeah, and merry-go-rounds of doom. Also, I forgot to plug in my audio and I'm not hearing a thing. There we go. That's much better. We just came from down there, and I tried going down there, but there's nothing I can do over there, so I gotta go through this way. And I gotta get through that door. And there's another save station. I kinda like these areas. I know it's like simulated. There's We're not really outside, but I feel like it's a good resting place. Fading data. Thank you for the shotgun shells. Oh, handle blueprints. Oh, hey, it's a guy. Oh, shoot. Ooh, a laser wall. That's some serious security. People put them up for a reason. You see one? That means there's something important on the other side. Quite right, comrade major. Not trying to get to Ah. Okay. All right, we're just going to ignore that. I'll I'll just deactivate it from the other side if I can. Ooh, a laser wall. That's some serious security. People put them up for a reason. If you see one, that means there's something important on the other side. Quite right, Comrade Major. The distribution center huh. we're looking for is, in fact, on the other side. But there's no way that didn't, it through that a didn't fall apart. There's a repair vendor up ahead. Try upgrading your equipment to increase your laser resistance. Not a pervy lunatic fridge. Yep. So, uh... Fridge's name is Nora. I'm getting, I'm finding a lot of shotgun shells. Oh wait, did I, did I uh, loot that crate over there again? I did not. There's nothing in these. Honey, you're back. What took you so long? I'm Sorry, so baby. Uh huh. Like I need to go through a laser wall. Preferably alive. What a silly idea, honey. That's awful risky. You should stay with me instead. I'll do whatever you want. I want you to give me the ability. Uh, just give me laser protection. Oh, so brutal. I'm shaking. Squirt your polymer inside me. Norris. Don't let her boss you around. We have no time to waste. Don't listen to him, big guy. He wants to drive us apart. Take off that stupid glove so we can stay together forever. I no, see. thank you. Do you want me to punch you or tear you apart? You'd really kill me over a stupid glove, sugar? How would you survive in this uh, cruel, violent world without All right, I get it. You'll get your polymer and your precious components. Just install the laser protection already. Whatever you say, stud. Upgrade initiated. Relax and enjoy. Just promise you'll talk dirty to me again. I am so good. Your defense system is active. Try to run through the laser wall. <laughs> After that creepy shit, I'd be willing to run through any wall. Crap! That hurt! That thing packs a punch. I almost bought the farm there. The key word being almost. You got that right. 
Cool, so now I got laser protection. Still hurts, though. That is a weird encounter. Ooh. What is that? Don't worry, honey. I'm right as rain. The operation was totally painless. Good. You need to leave right now. There's a man coming for you. He's armed and wearing an experimental polymer glove. Must be such a nice guy. Larissa, did you talk to him? He was attacked by a burab. We took him to the infirmary and then... Uh, I didn't know. I couldn't just let him bleed out. Well, you should have. It would have saved us a whole lot of trouble. It scares me when you talk like that. I'll meet you at the exit. I'm right behind Aww, you. Oh man. I just hope we're not too late. Hope can be dangerous. Hands up. Victor? What's going on? You deaf? Hands behind your head. Victor. The hell Victor? are you? Major Nachaya Special Operations. And that's the last question you get. You're going to Chelem. Victor, save yourself! Chelem. Of course, Comrade Major. Intrusion. Huh? Intrusion. What? Hey, freeze! Wait, what? Okay. Oh, no. Ah. Uh. No, I'm trying to switch weapons. I'm not trying to do that. What is that? Ah, what the? Can I loot these? I can't. He's good at ordering those robots around. It's almost like there is property. And he locked the goddamn door. Petrov ran off with a mobile power source called the Candle. It powers the emergency lockdown system. This door cannot be opened without a candle. Now I'll find another one. There's got to be more I... than one candle in this complex, right? We need to hurry. Otherwise, Petrov will escape the sector and we'll have to track him. Whoa, down whoa, wait. Okay. Alright, so that does that, but like... Okay, so that's... What's his name? Section Ra Romanoff? Charles, what's that birch tree encased in glass in the room down there? Is it the famous Peck 4 power generator? Indeed it is. The Birch Tree hmm. Peck 4 is a vegetative polymer based power generator. It's an experimental model. The first step of our program to conquer the distant planets of the solar system. Oh, that white thing seems important. Oh, that's the button. Never mind. Gimme, give gimme. Give oh, hey. You have a thing on your head. They're in the wall. Can you hear them? Scurrying around. I'm scared. I'm really scared of them. You've got nothing to be scared of. You're dead. Scared of what? Scared of what? The robots? No. Sorry, but I, I really don't uh, want to hear this. Oh, right shoot. Now. I meant to. I meant to. They're in the wall. Can you think Scared of what? The robots? No! Robots kill quickly and simply, but they... His lingering polymer memory is exhausted, Comrade Major. Got it. People here are getting killed by stuff other than robots. But what? I cannot ascertain. But I'd be lying if I said we'll never find out. Understood. So, there's other things? Like humans? Am I gonna fight humans, too? 
Whoa. I better have this shotgun out just in case I see something human. Oh, that's what this is. So, do I always have to carry it like this? The candle is a complex, unstable piece of equipment. It cannot be stowed in your backpack along with your other items. There is a high probability of mutual destructuralization. Like an explosion? Not necessarily. But the candle would be disabled. So I'll have to carry it like this. Got it. There we the go. The candle is quite durable. You can drop it or even throw it intentionally. Nothing will happen to it. Mm-hmm. So let me just... Oh, wait. Maybe I can... Can I cancel throwing it? I can't cancel throwing it. But I want to see what it does if I put it in this one. I guess I need two of them. Yeah, it doesn't do anything yet. I like having to hold it like this. Having telekinesis or polarity, is it? Those there we go. Are going nuts. Is this Petrov's doing? Be careful. Loaders are extremely durable. You won't be able to damage them with a simple axe. Shock therapy usually works pretty well on nut cases, metallic or otherwise. Maybe this can help me with anything. Robots. Uh. Robot on the latest routine psychological evaluation at Vevely Complex. Routine evaluation of Complex in 85, 86. Members of the Complex Junior Staff. This is not helping me at all. What is that? I don't know what that is, but it is nice to look at. I am liking it. Oh, those are the backsides of those lifters. Whoa. What was that? Yeah, that sounds like Petrov's voice. I hope that asshole's brains didn't get splattered all over the floor. We need Petrov alive. Hurry, Major. What the fuck does it look like I'm doing? Ow. Oh, shoot. Just follow the robot. It looks like there was a containment breach in the algae workshop, and experimental materials leaked out. That's actually good for us. Uh, shoot, shoot. It's coming at me, isn't it? Okay, no, it ain't. People often ask me why I, a neurosurgeon, am so dedicated to machines. Oh, I gotta go in that thing. I gotta go into polymer. How do I get in that? Whoa! Oh, I think I figured it out. I gotta wait till that thing comes back. Oh, I guess I gotta. I gotta uh, shoot it when it comes over here. Uh. All right, hold on. There we go. I didn't even need <laughs> I didn't even need to. Oh my gosh. Dude knock me. You can't get me in here, right? They also have lasers.
Give me your goo. That doesn't sound right. Give me your poly, normal, narrow, healing salve. Why is that have a face on it? Oh! Oh, shoot. There we go. No more dandelion flower. Hey, stop. Are you trying to repair that? Whoa. I think he could repair it. And anything else I should be afraid of? I should look out for? It's a weird song. But I like the girl's voice. Is that a radio of the future? Indeed it is. Professor Lebedev of the Academy of Consequences has developed a non-linear algorithm based on the principles of non-commutative quantum mathematics. Charles. Yes? Who are you just talking to? Forgive me. I'll explain it in terms you can understand. The Academy of Consequences has found a way to calculate musical radio waves from the future. They don't actually pick them up. This isn't a time machine after all. What you're hearing is based on a very specific mathematical calculation. A highly complex neuropolymer based algorithm. Neat. So it's AI radio. This is the lunar, a kind of lock. It'll open once all the holes have canisters of lunar soil in them. You eggheads sure love your fancy locks, don't you? Why? Yes, I'll go do... find some canisters. Why does it have lips and a nose? That is trippy. Is this all in polymer? This is weird. It's like being in a bottle of Vaseline. <laughs> no, uh, not Vaseline. Aloe vera. I can't get out. Jeez. Not that what is that? Lady robot perv again. Electro. Go around her. Nice. Not so fast, comrade major. I understand that interactions oh. with this model may be unpleasant for you, but it would be prudent to see if she has anything we can use. Fine. If I can get a good weapon out of her, I guess it'll be worth it. Oh, hey. Lunar soil. What do we have here? No. Don't count on it. Love it when you get angry. Yes, yes. Scold me. Punish me. I was a bad girl. Whoa. Don't do that. Wait. Oh, I thought she was about to like take me into her gang arms. <laughs> oh, cool. A pistol. I do. Energy weapons. Instead of bullets, energy weapons consume your gloves energy through your through a cable. Cool. I did my best. This is cool. For real. Now, could you please not kill anyone else? <laughs> I just can't help myself. Hot stuff. Well, just do your best, okay? Oh, this is fucking crazy. So 
Oh, that's what that, like, little, like, what is that? It's a, it's a bar in my bottom right. I didn't know what that was for, but now I do now. Charles, what does Petrov need with the repair vendor? Why would the sicko try to take control of Nora? Why would he even need weapons? He's got robots fighting for him. The traitor realized that employees confronted with hostile robots will defend themselves. And the soldiers defending the facility will attempt to get more powerful weapons. He must have been scared someone would bump into him by accident and shoot him like the traitorous piece of dog shit he is. That very well may be. Regardless, Petrov was unable to get his hands on a repair vendor. However, Nora... Nora what? Nor what? Ah, I was really, I was listening to what he was saying. Where the hell is it? It's over there, but like, I'm trying to make sure I don't get attacked by any robots. What the? Oh, it was always there. I just never picked it up, I guess. Sweet. Obviously, the last canister has to be lodged deep in the universe's quantum asshole. Does this stuff happen to everyone, or just me? I guess. Just Not you. I've got another one. Uh... Done. I think it worked. Sweet. Why does it have a mouth, though? Why does that lock have a mouth? Can I pick that up? Damn it. Yo! Step off, man. Ah, I'm aiming so weird. Ah, no. I'm in the salve. I'm in the salve. I'm in the goo. Get me out of the goo. Sorry, buddy. Same old shit. This pistol is as effective as my normal axe. So, if that's all... The same, I'll just rather use the axe. Close range. Ooh, that looks bad. So, what you're telling me is that these... Okay, so this scientist place, this lab is like creating robots and they're finding ways to like cultivate uh, or something the moon. Data. That's what you're telling me. Please select <sighs> the desired procedure. Abilities, I need to shoot better abilities. I got neuropolymer. Okay. What's this? Electrization. Shock electrifies enemies. Well, yeah, that's. I thought that I already did that. Amplified modulator. A modulator extend top of the get the top topology chain lightning okay so this is just about shock character frostbite I kind of like that mass telekinesis polymeric jet you get your glove can spray enemy targets and surface with a jet of combat polymer once applied combat polymer can be set on fire or frozen dealing damage of the corresponding type to affect enemies wow polymer shield your glove can surround your with Surround you with. <laughs> oh my gosh. I want to see what the frostbite can do. Your glove can hit 
targets and surface with jet. I, I get that. But I want uh, to see what this does. Let's see what this does. Okay. And also, uh, I want that too. So frostbite, you freeze enemies to slow them down for a while. Remember, a frozen enemy only takes a portion of the damage from your attacks and thaws out more quickly with each hit it takes. Got it. Wow. How do I... What is that one up thing? Okay. Well, I'll figure it out as, as I progress. Let me just save real quick. Cool. You're not really slowing down. There's not much I can do. There's some enemies up above. Is that an enemy? No. Ah, what the heck? Uh, I don't like this. I did not see that. Cool. So I can freeze enemies and I can shock them. Makes it really good to uh, do stuff like that. Any other enemies I should look out for? I want to check out over here real quick. Shouldn't forget to heal. Whoa, what the? That's weird. This pistol is good, but... I gotta be careful when I use it because dang it I hope he didn't look this way yo stop spinning at me who do you think you who do you think I am Oh no. I want to reload all the way. No, I. Hey! Yo! No! I gotta freeze you guys! Oh my gosh! Whew. 
That comes in hand handy. Mmm. I'm just gonna take this real quick. Sweet. Okay. Oh cool, and I can climb up here too. Give me all that loot. Give it to me. I'm doing pretty good right now. Whew. All right, where do I go now? Can't go that way. I'm liking this pistol now. It regenerates. It's basically infinite, but there's a limit to how many times I can use it. Still. And bah. No, what? No. Ow. Hey, stop repairing stuff. Maybe I should just not try to destroy these things. I'll just sneak past them. Because I don't want to keep fighting these robots when I don't have to. Ooh, what I get? Electromagnetic barrel. That sounds pretty interesting. What do you? I need to upgrade my weapon. Oh, that's oh, this is a new weapon. I have the Swede. I could get the. Well, I don't have enough, but let's see what I can do with this. What does this do? Ionize buckshot introduce electromagnetic interference to the target's electro electronic uh, system. Increase damage to robots, basically. I'd like that. Did I not upgrade it? All right. Okay, so, basically, more damage to robots. Same damage to humans. Weapon engonement? Uh, use energy weapons, guns, and melee weapons wisely in order to allocate your resources effectively. Thank you. I shall. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa.
Nice. Ooh, nice. I got an achievement. That is new. What the heck is that? Okay, I'm taking, I'm going back down here. That thing is knocking me down. No! I'm still alive. What the heck? Oh, that's my dodge meter. Ah! Huh. Okay. Steer clear of that sunflower, sunflower camera. I don't want to get more bots on me. I want to get back up there, though. How do I do that? Hmm. What is this? Overcome obstacles. Um. Okay. Oh! Convenient. There we go. What's going on? Oh, shoot. Not what I wanted. There we go. No more camera. Let's see what we got in here. I'm getting good at these. At least I can dodge them now. Yo! Oh, okay. Nice. Ah, shoot. Okay. Wop. was right they do repair their things they repair and then they die it's kind of counter efficient what is I really want to know what this poly aloe vera is Oh, this is new. Oh.
This is new. Hmm. Oh, I got it. Nope, I don't. There we go. I'm loving these. Okay, so I do gotta go the way, I or I don't have to go. You've got nowhere to run. I'll give you ten seconds to surrender. Oh, uh, I hope that's not him. According to biometric readings, this is Patrol. It is? Crispy critters. Shit. Ah. Really uh. I had a feeling it'd end this way. Wizard, this is P3. Come in. Wizard here. Have you found Petrov, my boy? I found his body. He's been decapitated. A loader turned his skull into blood pudding. Damn. His head contained codes I would have used to end this nightmare quickly. I'm sorry, Dr. Oh. Sechenov. I was too late. <sighs> then we'll have to solve the problem another way. Did he have any rings on him? Two gold rings? Uh, no rings, sir. Just a candle. Understood. I need you to report to the VDNH at once, B3. We've got bigger problems than Petrov to deal with. Wait, what, what the? Worse than Petrov? Stockhausen will debrief you at the VDNA. There we go. No. Hurry. Yeah. Time there we go. The Do I make myself clear? I my record. Ten four wizard. Almost an hour. All right. I know. I knew it was a good idea to bring this ring. Uh, candle, not ring. Candle. Woo 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 woo! I love these things. Internal head core power generator microclimate readings are suboptimal. Electricity canister required. The energy from the candles isn't sufficient to power the main gate, but installing them. Activated a system that provides special polymers to the birch tree life support system. The life support system has four primary functions. Maintaining optimal temperature, eliminating insects. In other words, four columns, four canisters. A solution to a problem. I'm smoking. Charles, I'm in the hot shop. Am I going to turn into a crispy critter if I stay in here too long? No, the laboratory tables in the hot workshop or thermarium require high temperatures. But the temperature within the shop itself is quite comfortable. Oh, and Comrade Stalin just added fuel hmm. to the fire. Holy shit. What the heck is that? Where did all these monsters come from? A mere hypothesis, but I suspect they're the bodies of dead soldiers that have been infected by sprouts. A fucking hypothesis? Are you shitting me? It's merely my own determination. This has never happened before. Fuck me. So uh, how did it happen? I guess that something went wrong with the sprouts after Petrov caused the malfunction. Uh, by making pipes. That is sides. disgusting. Now we cool. ended up with an unhealthy nationwide addiction. I suggest introducing a special kind of tobacco to the market. It contains almost no nicotine and is completely free of harmful tar. And, most importantly, it gradually introduces an aversion to smoking. It's cheap to make and can easily replace ordinary tobacco. We could help two-thirds of Soviet smokers kick the habit in just five years. It's looking at me. Does it know I'm here? Nope. Oh shoot, it knows I'm here. It knows I'm here. Oh my gosh, their heads. 
their heads have been turned into like some kind of weird ew maybe this will help me uh, figure out where these things have come from heard about the thing they grew in the germination department I heard it's something between a Venus flytrap and a gigantic hemlock plant what's that about who knows it's just a little genetic mishap and now it's more like a carnivorous animal than a plant they even took a whole tank of PA 400 over there for it they should have nipped the thing in the bud. They're gonna get themselves in trouble over there. For sure. Ah, it should be fine if they keep spraying it. Uh, so they made a... So these are called Venus Man Traps. Good to know. Alright. I can't go that way. Blast. Then I'll have to go this way. Fast. So now we got robots and plant zombies. Freaking critters. This place just keeps getting more and more fucked up. Okay, what the? Oh, yo. Okay, so you can stun, like, organic matter, too. Cool. I'm gonna need to save my shotgun bullets. Does this do anything to these guys? Okay, it does. Oh my gosh. Freeze. Take that bitch. Ah. Okay, so now they spit an acid. Great. Can I sneak up on these guys? Ah, oh, come on. Yeah. Jeez. How many of you are there? Gee, these are gross and cool, but really gross. All right. Oh, and one more. No, shoot! What the fudge? What the hell? What the... What? No! Whoa, I cannot let that... That thing just thrusts towards you. What the heck? Okay, so they have fire or something like that. What the heck? <sighs> All right. Oh, it's a... Uh, what kind of robot is that? It's a silly one. A chunky one. Uh... You got this guy drains my health.
I just need time to to <laughs> suck up some health stuff and then shoot the hell out of this thing. I could fight these things for a while. <laughs> they just like uh just they all does everything here want to taste of me hmm there we go i'm good at these i'm a good puzzle mm, nowhere Oh, whoa. What is that? Shit, that Hedgie's lost it. Fuck my life. This is usually a harmless geodesic geology robot. What the? Harmless it can run on walls? What other tricks does it have up its sleeve? I'm not sure. I don't have access to this model's data. I wish it didn't have access to us. I couldn't agree more, Comrade Major. Come on, let's go find that canister. At least we won't have to find the door to the shop. We can just climb through the window. Sweet. Ooh, what's this? PM ammo. What is PM ammo? Right. Um. Okay, so... Please like, share, subscribe, and hit that bell button to see more information like this. If you don't want to hit that bell button, that's fine. Go check out my Discord because I have my videos notify Discord every time a new video pops up on my channel. Also, I'm trying to build a community. You know, communi communicate, community, stuff like that. I also have a Twitter if you guys want to check that out and a Twitch as well. But uh, that's all I got for now. Please enjoy your day, and I will see you all later or next time, but never, never. So, uh, yeah. Bye.